All right, this is the uh, this is my QAV 400 with the new KK 2.1 board. Um, it has Stevis 1.10 firmware on it. Um, tried the stock settings out; they seemed a little too soft for uh, FPV and the way I like to fly. Didn't seem locked in; it seemed to drift and roll. Um, so I did some changes on some settings, and I'll go through those. And what I did is I went into the PI editor, and this is for roll and pitch. Uh, P is 300, I is 225. And then for the yaw, yaw I changed to 225, I, the P is 225, and the I is 175. These seem pretty good. I'm not seeing too much oscillation through the view through, through my uh, screen, but I won't really know till I get the uh, flight video home. So that's the uh, PI editor changes. And then also I changed, let me see, go down, stick scaling, stick scaling, I changed 999 and 90. And I changed the self level settings. Uh, when I went to self level, the P gain is 50, P limit's 30, seems pretty good. I never fly in self level, I totally fly in manual. Just have this as a backup, I guess. I can flip the switch and go to, to self level. Anyway, it was uh, drifting to the right, so I changed the ACC trim roll to minus eight, and that corrected the drift to the right, a minus eight. It didn't go forward or backwards, so the ACC trim pitch is on zero still. All right, what else we got here? One more thing I changed was the MPU 6050 settings. Um, on this on this firmware, the 1.10 firmware, the, the default was eight. I was just on Steve's blog and he said change it to two, so I changed it to two. Not sure if it made any difference or not. Seemed a little soft, so I am now on four. Seems pretty good. So the gyro degree second is 200, ACC is four. Filter is 256. And those are the only changes I have made. And so here is a flight. And you can see how it's working. I uh, hope you enjoy the flight. Mm -hmm.